Hello everyone, so I've just walked into Dollar Tree and I immediately noticed that there are quite a few items that are new for Christmas. Like this is so cute with the tiara. They have this one as well. The buckets, the Santa buckets or pails I should say, lots of lights. See, isn't this cute? Lots of snuggly socks. I love this one with the Christmas tree print, or these I should say. They have lots of bags here for baked goodies or for making loop bags. I really like this bag. I actually pack, purchased a pack of these because I love the gingerbread print on it. It's so cute. Lots of craft material if you're a DIYer. I know you'll really appreciate this entire unit here. It's covered in all sorts of goodies. A lot of the bottle brush trays are still available, which is amazing. And so much wood. So many pieces of wood. Like these ones here, you don't spot at all the Dollar Trees. Oh, these are new to me. They have a snowman. It's like the skeleton almost. And then they also have a little elf. Cute. I have a little truck, they're doing a garland. Yelly D candles with timer, they sell really fast, so somebody hasn't spotted them yet up there, otherwise they'd be gone. These would be nice if you glittered them or painted them on the inside. They also have the cloche, they're plastic, and then a whole bunch of little picks. Oh, these are kind of newer to me. I feel like I haven't seen them anywhere else. Lots of stockings here. Oh, it looks like there's a little fundraiser going on. I think I'm going to look a little bit into that. And they have all the paper napkins. Oh, Christmas cards. So some of you have been asking if I've spotted them. I have shared them in previous walkthroughs, but I'll share quickly what's here. Some things I haven't seen, like I haven't seen this little gnome, but most of the other ones it looks like I have spotted. We've seen this one, a little house or a farmhouse. Yep, we've seen this one. Seen all of these. Seen the little dog. And it's always the same print, right? And these ones, I think it is. Some book boxes have like a variety pack, but for the most part, these are all the same print that you see on the front. The snowman's new to me, I think. These here are a variety pack, but you only get 12 cards. See the other boxes, it looks like you get a little bit more. You do get a variety. Oh my goodness. Let me fix this. Lots of cookie containers or storage containers, whatever you use, use them for. They have a lot of tin, plastic, now I've heard that the pink one here has a different lid. I don't know if anyone is able to let me know. Nope, this one looks like it's the same. Um, what the lid is, other than cookies for Santa, that would be so helpful. Because I love the side, but I just don't like the top. I haven't seen these before. So cute. Santa is coming. That's my this one's adorable. I love the little letters. If your kiddo has some writing to, to Santa, that's a great way to encourage some letter writing. We used to do that with the kids when they were little. 
one was more engaged than the other for sure. There are a few more here that I pulled out from the back. So there's this one with the red truck and some trees. Joy to the world. And then they have some other prints here. I love the ones with the clear top as well. Great for cookie giving. The icicles come too in a pack. Is it like a blue white light or is it a cool light or a warm light? Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. These are the really beautiful snowflakes that I've been looking for. I can't even believe I just missed them almost. No wonder I haven't found them anywhere else. I probably passed right past them. These are pretty as well. They had some more minimalist looking snowflakes at a couple of the locations. They have tons of the white bell balls here and some new signs that I haven't seen before. How cute. It looks like we're still pretty well stocked at this location. I guess the ornaments have sold really quickly because they aren't there aren't as many left, but everything else seems pretty well stocked. How are your stores looking? They have some white trees. Last year these sold so fast and they still have some green trees. I'm looking to see if they have that crushed velvet, those gorgeous bows that I bought last year. And they were like neutral colors. I haven't spotted any this year. Cute socks here too gingerbread print with the coffee or hot cocoa we'll take a look at some of the gift bags looks like they have some new boxes gift bag prints that we haven't seen anywhere else at least i haven't look at this three in a pack cute little prints they are quite glittery so it depends if you like that i like the look of this you can even use this for paper crafting the plaid bag in there little boxes these tend to sell fast by the way some colorful fill filler I don't remember seeing these it's a red truck and a red truck as well here oh. happy holidays Sometimes it's tricky to share these because they fall off the pegs so easily. But they're snowmen. I really like some of these. They're a little bit more moody. Oh, this one is different too. Oh, we've seen these. Yep, but the sleigh. So they're just like a nighttime bag. I don't know. They're really pretty. Lots of tags here. Different sticker books. These will be gone shortly because I've seen them disappearing pretty fast from the stores. I love these tags. I keep buying them for my paper crafts. I have some cute prints. Little boxes. Oh, this one's my favorite. Because I want to do a gingerbread theme pocket letter. I have to get on that. Oh my gosh. Yes. Tomorrow's December 1st already. I can't even believe November is gone. Some pretty paper here. So I have to get on my baking. I have to start. Are you guys baking anything special this holiday season? Are you a baker? Do you enjoy doing it? Is there something you always go to? I'm just going to move the cart out of the way here and share with you some of the sprinkles. They have some sprinkle kits. This one is new. Oh my gosh, it has gingerbread men. Oh, they're so stinking cute. I have to buy these. My daughter is going to love them. I thought these were gingerbread as well, but they're actually little moose or deer. 
I feel like last year I found some with the little gingerbread man print, but maybe I didn't buy them at Dollar Tree and I'm getting confused. These are micro eggs, so they're really tiny, which is great for baking meats as well. They have lots of treats here and candy canes if you're looking for stocking stuffers. These are kisses. They're the, the candy cane one, the white chocolate with the little red strips, stripes. <laughs> lots of chocolates. Oh, there's a few of these mugs still kicking around, which I'm surprised. I thought these would be long gone. There's one gnome left here on the shelf and some new Christmas glasses. I don't think this is a staple at Dollar Tree because um, I've found a different bottle before and they have some new types of like, I guess, flossing things. So there's gum, there's these tongue cleaners. I think they're plastic. these are contact lens cases but I actually just purchased one of these because I'm going to transform it into like a little trinket holder for paper crafting but to send out as happy mail looks like they have a ton of new things here for baby what how do you scrub your baby with this I don't know has anyone used it it's like a little silicone scrubber and then there's baby food here, and that's all brand name stuff too, even Huggies. This is probably not going to work, it doesn't look like it had, would have good suction. Here's a new item mini silicone popsicle mold and it's bpa free it says i don't know if anyone's tried it huh? we'll take a look down the makeup toiletry section they have lots of different razors here some brand named ones this is new micro needling looks like it's built into the little sheet i've never seen this before just checking on the brand we will these are new as well eyeshadow switching sponge hmm. always coming out with something new and then they have all the Ioni things tweezers rollers little cleaning brush Looks like little blush sets or eyeshadow palettes. Yeah. Has anyone tried this? I'm curious. It does come in a little glass bottle and it's a shimmer serum. Lots of makeup. Very neat and organized. I'll go through here nice and slow so you can see. Lots of lipsticks, eyeliners, lip oils, lipsticks. Just so many different things here. See these lip oils? Has anyone tried them? We have the mascara by Wet n Wild. They have Ioni glitter liner, so it's like almost gold. It'd be interesting for Christmas, maybe. Lots of new nail polishes, and they're all metallic here. They look like they're selling well, so they must be a hit. You can use them for crafting too. You can paint little things, even little molds. If you have Christmas molds, you can accent them with these really nice metallic nail polishes. That's what we would do sometimes. Dollar Tree has a really nice selection as well for nails, it's like for many things. If you're doing your own faux nail application, they have a great selection. I want to take you down 
all the hair accessories it's something i don't focus enough on and look at this eye candy oh my gosh when my daughter was younger she would have loved this what a fantastic little find so they have oh even more here little hair accessories just so many different options you can put a really nice you can put some great things in a stocking Dollar Tree also has this whole section with it's just bath things. So if you need a bath mitt or hair towel, scrubber, exfoliator, they have so many things. So these aren't always readily available. I find maybe in the spring and summer, they're gone most of the time because when I was looking for them for a craft purpose, I couldn't find them. Do you like using these? they wash the bottles well oh they have some new um sponges here i have to share with you so they're sheets quick eraser sheets i've been meaning to try them and then i'm kind of hesitant these are really scratchy Dollar Tree has been putting out some new cleaning tools and accessories and it's always nice to see like things that you can reuse like something like this I'm actually thinking I wonder if it fits my wood yeah I don't know I like things that you can reuse wash reuse wash reuse this is interesting and some of you have had really great reviews on it Last year they had a really tall skinny toilet bowl cleaner in a blue bottle that I absolutely loved. It was so good and I haven't seen it come back. Has anyone else seen it? I think some of you also tried it after I recommended it and, and really liked it. There's only one in the pack here, SOS. Hmm, interesting, they're starting to make these types of sponges. I'm going to take a look at some of their baking supplies because I'm going to start putting together my Christmas baking. Oh, they have lime and lemon. But actually, you know what, I might grab some. I don't know, I think that this is a pretty good value, 100 grams, right? If I bought them at Bulk Barn, I don't know. I'm gonna have to do some math here, but 120 grams. Yeah, see, there's 100 grams unsweetened, and then some are sweet, so just be mindful when you're reading the, the tags here. I have to do my, I do have to do some calculations, because I'm just not sure if it's worth it. Anyways, I'm also looking for Mother's Made Cherry Pie Filling, and I haven't seen it. Not apple, not cherry. And you have been spotting the cherry pie filling, which is my favorite. This is new here. So I'm a little envious of those who have, because that is my favorite. I just absolutely love the cherry pie filling from Mother's Meat. This looks like a great value. Sea salt, and it's not the coarse one. And it's a brand name as well. I love these cookies. I just haven't tried the chocolate ones, so I like the plain ones. But the S cookies, are, the originals are so good. Ground ginger. It's normally pricier. Oh, rosemary too. I never look at this stuff. I'm going to be doing baking, so I'm going to pass up on buying any cookies. These are new. Now, if they just didn't have this middle line in here, I would love them. But they're a little bit too heavy looking for me. 
like if you put a taper candle, right? Is that what these are called? So pretty. I hope you enjoyed walking through Dollar Tree with me today. Just wanted to share with you that the snowflakes I purchased, there's a smaller one and a larger one. And they're just absolutely stunning in the Christmas tree. So I'm just going to position them here to show you. I want to say thank you so very much for walking through the store with me today. I hope you enjoyed. And until next time, everyone, bye for now. And Christmas is my favorite time of year It's beginning to look like all my wishes Are coming true, that's why I cheer I've been busy decking the halls I've been kind to big and small And now it's time to have a merry holiday what a feeling when it's time for Christmas. Let's sing a carol and we'll bring it here. Let's sing a carol and we'll bring it here.